Hello and welcome back. We're uh, we're taking on our neighbor here, Darius of the Persian Empire. As you can see, um, he doesn't have feudalism yet. He's got his immortals, uh, which are horsemen, um, but uh, he should be pretty pretty easy to take out. They don't have longbowmen yet, so um, let's go ahead and do that. Let's just get this war started. Yes, declare war. And uh, let's take this whole stack in here and uh, smash him. All right, we got some reinforcements over here. Let's send them, <clears throat> send them to the front and send this guy to the front. And um, these guys are protecting my mine over here. Let's get rid of this so we can see a little better. Yeah, we don't need that right now. So, um, I wonder if I should upgrade a couple of Axemen. Yeah, just, just two. Uh, get an Axemen upgraded and a Spearman. Just in case they do, a, do attack me. Alright. Yeah, they don't really have much at all, so, uh, as far as military goes. So, this should be a pretty easy war for us. And then, uh, we're researching feudalism ourselves. Uh, 24 turns, but I, I'll be getting some gold from our, our invasion forces over here. So, um, do I want to go ahead and attack? Let's see what our odds are. 23% with our catapult. We got 18% with our, we'll wait one turn so that we can get, um, do some collateral damages with our, our, uh, catapults. But right now, uh, I gotta take care of this guy, and um, let's see what what are we working on over here. Okay, so kind of need food. Um, do I want to be this close? Yeah, that's fine. Let's just defend up here, just in case he does something funny. And uh, let's send this guy home. Ooh, uh, let's just send him over here for now. We got Spearman over there. Okay, send this guy to safety. <clears throat> and then, uh, yeah, uh, it's in the turn. Okay, they got their immortals out. I'm probably going to lose some catapults, so let's go with some more catapults uh, from Paris because uh, I'm going to attack and I'll probably lose some um, this turn. So let's upgrade them. Attack. We're ta they are settled on a hill. Their capital is not on a hill, so that should be a little bit easier. Doesn't look like they got walls yet. They might rush walls. Okay, it looks like I lost a couple of catapults, but uh, they're very wounded. So let's do three guys. And take them out. Yes, install new governor. And uh, we'll go with library. Okay, over here, you'll build a farm, and um, just head on down here. Okay, we got, let's just get this guy up here to defend our territories from this Axeman. You're just going to defend, and you're going to head on out to the front. And these guys, I want somebody in here. And our catapults are not too damaged, really, so that's pretty good. Um, we've got a spearman and a warrior. So we'll just uh, let's go to next turn. And I got some gold, cause, so I want to kind of rush uh, feudalism a little bit, because I got 170 gold from that taking that city. So let's go to the next turn. Um... Do I want to get Aqueduct? No, not right now. I've uh, got a new Spearman. We'll send him to the front lines. And uh, you're... I can't reach him, unfortunately. But what I can do... Move up here, block him off. And he does have an Immortal there. 
So upgrade. I might be vulnerable to attack from that guy. And I definitely can't do any damage to that guy. This warrior might be dead, but that's okay. We'll just do some scouting with him. <clears throat> so I'm going to go ahead and send my catapults on to the attack and send him. We will send... We'll leave one Axeman and one Spearman for the town. And these two will go with the main attack. And you'll go in there for this turn. And you two get defend the town. Uh, yeah, uh, we want a little bit of a defense. Um, let's go ahead and put him here. In case they want to try to attack me. All right, let's see what they do. See what if they attack that axeman. Okay, of course they got my warriors. That's fine. Oh, good. He did some damage. He did some real good damage. Wow! I can't believe I won that battle. That's amazing. Let's get some uh, archers to defend my new my new lands. And there's his uh, swordsman. Of course he went there. But I don't have anything built there, so I'm going to go there. And uh, we'll send most of these guys out, except for maybe an axeman and a spearman. And, of course, send him. And then, because I want my catapult to go here. And these guys are just going to defend the road. Oh, they're defending the town. I want these guys to defend the road. We'll give them a combat motion. You gotta move. Well, I gotta move him because he can. He can reach me. That's unfortunate. Um, let's go over here and just build a mine there. And um, Paris is really unhealthy, but let's go build a town over here. Get more catapults to the front lines. And uh, we'll blockade this mountain path. Good job, warrior. Can't believe he won that battle. Uh, is that jungle? Yeah. And you go to the front. And uh, we'll attack their capital next turn, I'm thinking. Okay, the warriors finally did. Killed by their immortal. We want a couple more archers, of course. And uh, can't defeat that guy. We'll just park him here. Uh, I will attack this. But now we're vulnerable. He's got an immortal in there, so let's send our archer up here. And uh, get that guy moving. Join the assault. Although, you know what? I should probably... Let's see. He's just got a swordsman, an archer, an axeman, and an immortal in there. I think I might be able to just take it just with my swordsman. Uh, 30% odds. Let's see our strongest guy. What you got? Oh. What do you got? 69%. So let's take these two and just attack. Oh boy, that's, that's unlucky. 270% attacks we lost there. But we got rid of their capital, so uh, I think it's worth it. Uh, didn't really give us anything. What about this city? This was their biggest city. They didn't have any great buildings. No wonders. Uh, that's too bad. So we'll move on up and uh, continue with the assault. Kind of low, and you can... Uh, I think I was building a house here. 
and uh, you can build a house here. Should automate my workers soon because it's a little bit too much. We can move these guys in here with the main assault because there's no no one threatening us just yet. If I just uh, keep on attacking, I should be able to get. Let's get some swordsmen to replace those two that I lost, and send them over here. Just keep on going to the front, people. And we're just going to defend over here. Well, you know what? Let's go to the hill. Actually, do I have a... No, I can't. I'm not going to do that. Just defend right there. Um, that's fine. Get all our guys in the capital here. And uh, rest up. Uh, we can start sending guys. He needs to rest up. Sending guys up to the next city. Alright, but we do need to heal up. Unfortunately, I don't think I can get anybody to combat. Um, the combat. Uh, I mean, the, the medic promotion. Because um, I could really use that. And uh, we'll have this guy. Uh, we'll send them along too. And get some more swordsmen that are rested. These guys are all rested. So that's fine. We'll send them up with our main forces. And we got a, uh, a worker out of the deal. Let's we'll just start automating workers now. So I want to go into options. Make sure that automated workers leave old improvements. That's checked. So we'll just go to the next turn. We'll just automate these guys. That's fine. We don't need to micromanage that anymore. We got five turns to feudalism. When we do that, we'll vassalize him. I definitely want to get Sousa, though. That way I'm not blocked off and I can uh, expand up north. Uh, get that stone, I think. So, yeah, we'll just continue to build some more troops. Because this battle might take a little bit longer. Uh, they got guys standing out in the open. Which is really dumb for them. Let's, uh, let's uh, promote. Well, let's just go. Good. We won that. Let's send our whole... Formation out. Send this guy out. And this will should prevent them from getting any more uh, axemen or anything like that because they no longer have access to... Well, they no longer, long longer have access to horses because they took out their horses. And they shouldn't have access to iron much longer either. So, uh, send you there. These two guys... Join the main assault. We don't need to worry so much about defending these cities anymore because they're pretty protected. They're far behind their their our own lines now. So uh, these uh, they're not really building much. Oh, they've gotten more horses over there, um, but they don't they don't have a worker to work it. So um, I'm gonna just build a few more troops, even though I probably don't need them. But uh, better safe than sorry. They might be useful in the future. All right. Yeah, same here. Let's uh, send you up here just to defend our northern front. Let's go up here. You two. Get that medic promotion. Heal up. going to defend here. Keep sending our guys up. We're running out of money, but uh, we should have feudalism in three turns. I think we have three turns, and we'll take another city soon. So let's go ahead and start building forges, because I think we got enough military to handle these guys. In fact, I may do a settle or two to get that stoned, although we're losing so much money 
that maybe I don't want a new settlement just yet. I plan on vassalizing him, not wiping him out. Uh, although, I don't know. So they're down to 0%. Let's send our catapult. We'll lose him, probably. Nice. Now send these guys in. Okay. Um, I want a stone. I wonder if they have it. I don't have good scouting information up here. Let's give, send him up here. So I send my main army up and leave these guys here? Or do I want to... Maybe I don't want to vassalize him because... Uh, um, it is a small island. So I am the largest civilization. Darius is the smallest, of course. He might be completely wiped off the map. Can I reach him? Yes, I can. So I got another worker. Thank you very much. Um, let's just send these guys up. I don't know why I'm going on the roads. Um, automate these workers. Defend this guy. Uh, gonna send him up. Send him up. All right. And uh, get to heal up as much as we can. But send all the healthy guys up. Leave our medic. And that's it. Send the rest of the guys on up. And I'm gonna heal up, upgrade my catapults. And heal him up. Just keep on keep pressing the attack. I just want this guy to scout out, see if that I can get that stone. Cause stone is great for building wonders. I will to my Lord be Although I think all the stone wonders are loves, it might be gone by now. All which he shuns. Uh, let's get sailing. It's just one turn. We'll build forges because um, I think this we don't really need much more military. Um, you know what? I should. I got a pretty big force here. Let's uh, defend. And I got to lower that down a little bit. We'll send a catapult over here and uh, keep on with the attack. And automate this guy. Um, let's see. Just keep on moving up. Keep on moving up. Move these guys up. Yep. And they, we won't be raising the city. They have at least two population. Build, you build a library. We'll keep on sending more guys up to the front lines. Okay. So this city, whenever we get enough... Okay, it looks like they've sacrificed a population for something. Because uh, it's down to one. It was at two. I think when you sacrifice a population it, and it goes down to one, it won't be raised when you attack it. I don't know. Um, we need to... We don't have much over here. So let's send... Let's expedite that. And... Uh, so we can start attacking... The other two, I don't think I'm going to vassalize him. Um, I don't see the benefit of that, and I need these resources. And we got wine over here. So um, we'll just continue. To, we'll just wipe him out completely. Okay, we need calendar because we've got a lot of things uh, that need to be built. 
I mean that a lot of tiles that need to be improved over here. Um, yeah. So you have some culture. Go ahead and attack. We lost the catapult. That's fine. Okay, they do have another city up here. We got another city. Um, let's build a uh, board house because we're going to be pretty low on funds. So just keep on attacking. Yeah. Automate my guys. Got a great general. Let's see. Where do you think I want to build my heroic epic? Probably, uh, might be here. What's my production here? 10? Not very great. Um, Lions, maybe Orleans. Yeah, I'm thinking Orleans. Let's see. We can mine up here, mine up here. It give us good production. Yeah, that'll be a good city for our heroic epic. So, we'll move him here. Get some guys to defend that catapult. We'll move this whole stack, in fact. And we got an archer defending, so we don't need to defend it. Just keep on pressing the attack. Get more and more cities. Hopefully it doesn't make us bankrupt. Okay, I can't reach. What are they doing? They're sending guys. They're sending their workers to me. <laughs> but no, they uh, they weren't doing that. Okay. So. Why can't I? Yeah, I can't. Let's just uh, lower the defenses. No, no need to rush it. We got plenty of guys, but we don't need to rush it. Um. We'll leave the Axemen here, send these guys on their way. You go on your way, you defend. And I'm going to build my military instructor here in Orleans. Orleans will be my, I'll build my heroic epic here, although it's not on the coast, which is kind of unfortunate. All right, we'll just keep going. Keep pressing the attack. Let's build a monastery. Alright. Attack. My axemen will be better. No. I might as well wait one more turn. Let's take a look at my budget. How much am I spending on unit costs? 16 unit costs. So. I actually don't mind if I lose some units here. Yeah, I lost a couple guys. That's fine. And you go take the city. All right, another city is ours. Build a library. We're going to move these guys out. And uh, just defend. And I think uh, we got the wine over here. But do I have wine? Uh, I can always trade for it. He's not going to have many resources. And I have tons of resources to trade. There, I do have wine. So I'm going to leave him this city because I want the stone. But I don't really care about anything here. Um, I'll get the sheep. So, yeah, we'll vassalize him as soon as I take Gordian. Gordian. Yeah, sounds good. I'll leave him this one city. And this will give me the bronze, too, so that's good. All right. Now, do I care about this city? It's 
Got fish. Do I have fish? Do I have fish anywhere? There's some clam. Do I have fish? I don't have fish, so I do want that city. So we do want this last city here. And we'll leave one Axeman here, and we'll go take the last city. And you just defend here. And uh, this war is not really costing me much. Build the temple. Build the courthouse. Save some money. And uh, he destroyed something, plundering my fishing boats. That's fine. Uh, I don't really have any axemen over here. Yeah. He's blocking my path. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. We'll just go around him. Uh, was that smart? Is he going to take back the city? He can't. It's in my, it's in my zone of influence. So, and um, yeah, let's send this guy up here just in case. And uh, we'll just park him here. We'll send these guys out here, but they probably won't be necessary. All right, let's keep going. So we got, uh, we'll go with a uh, temple. This is going to be my... I, I don't know if I want to build the heroic epic there. That guy is just going to be a pain, isn't he? But that's fine. You know, he can destroy those roads. I got plenty of workers. Just defend. And we'll take his last... Well, the last city, and then we'll, make, we'll peace out with him. Two more turns. We should be able to take that. He's only got a swordsman and an axeman. Okay, he is attacking me, but I should win that, and I did. He did uh, take out my. That's good. So let's uh, go here. Just defend. Defend. Actually, uh, send him. And it's not, they don't have walls, they don't have, um, uh, wall, uh, it's, they're not on a hill, so it should be pretty easy to take out. So, granary, let's take out their defenses, we'll hit them next turn, and it'll be over. Everything there All right, we need money because we are uh, running a deficit right now. Yeah, we will run out of money in 190 turns. All right, so... We are really, we've got to peace out with him and vassalize him. Hopefully he gives us currency too. Thank you very much. Let's do open borders. Now, um, I have two wine. Yep. Cool. Everything is worth. That worked out really well. Uh, what do I want to go to next? Try to get the Parthenon, maybe? Let's check out my religion. I'm missing three cities. Do I need to build missionaries? Probably not. Because they should just adapt the religion on their own. Um, 
we got a lot of cities. It's going to take a while for them to develop a little bit. We're going to have to build courthouses to reduce our maintenance costs. Get our expenses down. Let's build a lot of courthouses. i am probably build the Ridden Palace. All right. We'll get a Scotland Yard going in our capital. That will give us a lot more spying, although we don't really care because we don't have a neighbor. Um wonder if there's any more wonders that we could go for. Yeah, we have stone now. Let's go ahead and build another wonder. And we can start pumping out great profits, I think. Uh, we got the we got the Great Wall. We got a great oracle. We got the Stonehenge. So we'll get a lot of great persons here. Let's get the... Uh, Let's get a wonder in Paris, the Chichen Itza. All right. Uh, do I want to build the Moai statues here? It's not too many uh, water tiles here, so no. I don't think I want to do it here. Let's uh, get more money from get the market going. Just defend. Send you back up there. And. Um, I can uh, increase my research a little bit. Yeah, so that war went really well. Uh, they weren't very powerful. Um, they, I left them with one city. They'll probably, they might try to colonize a little bit more, but uh, might settle somewhere. Maybe here. I don't know. Probably not because, well, they're sending a, a guy there. All right. It's 1060. I need to try to get optics. I think that's what I'm going to go for next. Um, someone built the Colossus. That's fine. I want this uh, Chichen Itza. And he wants ivory. I don't really need wine. That's fine. Cancel a lot of that. Let's build a market. We need money. We've gotta focus on research. Maybe I can get the great library. Um, I don't know how many, like, if is the Great Library already built? I don't know. It doesn't look like it's showing up as an option. So it probably, it's probably already built. Uh, yeah, we'll boost it for 12 gold. We lost a little bit of pop, uh, food, but that's fine. Art for art's sake is an empty phrase. Art for the sake uh, of truth. Art for the sake of the good and the beautiful. That is the faith that I... Okay, let's do literature. If there's still time for it, we'll build the Parthenon. We'll just do a lot of wonders right now. All right, he wants to give us horseback riding for metal casting. Sure. Some books are to be tasted, others to be swallowed, and some few to be chewed and digested. Let's see. Let's go with, I want to get optics so I can start, I can see what the rest of the world is up to. So let's uh, do machinery, then optics. If you speak the truth, have a foot in the stirrup. And I don't have a lot of coastal towns. Well, this is probably going to be my best coastal town. Oh, someone built the great library, so I can't do that. That's unfortunate. Uh, we'll do forge. Get that production bonus. I'm up to 40% research. I really want to see what the rest of the world is up to, so. All right, where do I want to build the Moai statues? Somewhere that has a lot of water tiles. Um, 
So we got one, two, three, four, five, six. You would be perfect for that. Um, and you don't have a lot of production. So yeah, you definitely need that. Uh, they're removing jungles over here. Okay, we got the uh, Parthenon. Good. Any other wonders? National Epic. We want to build the National Epic here, yes. So let's do that and get the, get the great people going. And uh, Orleans, I said. Um, but do I want to build this on a coastal city? Uh, probably. We don't have gold. I'm surprised with all our territories, we don't have gold yet. Um, wasn't there still a quest to do the Colosseum? We don't want to build any settlers. They got a settler. It's fine. I don't care. We could try to settle right here, I think. We'll see if they do that. Nope, they went up there. Um, I might end up taking that with a culture push. So this is where I want the heroic epic, I think. But it's not giving me that option. Why? Now, why can't I build the heroic epic here? It requires barracks. Let's build the barracks here. Wait, I don't want... I got all those production from there. No, I don't want to build it. I don't know where I'm going to build it, to be honest. But uh, I really want to get optics and see what the other, other side of the world is doing. They're probably way ahead of us. I mean, it's 1210 AD already. Uh, we're well into the Middle Ages. Um, so... What do I want to build here? Nothing really. Um, wealth. Uh, build a lighthouse. Uh, I wonder if Gordium is better for the Moai statues. Yeah, let's just build a forge here. We'll build a. Can't. So I have to cancel it here. Build it here. Yeah. Gordium's going to be better for that. Got more water tiles. Uh, I think I want to build the heroic epic on a... Uh, need money. I got to keep an eye on this. Uh, for when... I need to build the Forbidden Palace. Orleans might be a good place for that. It's kind of close to my capital. I wanted to, like, Susa would be good for that. Maybe here? I don't know. A god from the machine. All right. We're built, we're researching Compass. I think it's uh, about time to put in another cut. I think this is a good time. In the next episode, we'll hopefully we're going to get optics and we'll see what our neighbors are up to. All right, thanks for watching.